Valerie's famous seasoning, cooking slowly on the grill pan. We have the guacamole. It's just avocados, onion, lime juice, and a little salt and pepper. And of course, I prepped the chicken over here on my separate plastic cutting board, and I've got to get rid of the excess chicken parts. And just as a note, look at these beautiful fresh tomatoes sitting on the counter and peaches. It must be summertime, all right? So we'll come back for the finished product soon.
myself up with the chicken sandwich and I'm all set to go. I'm going to put it on some just whole wheat bread with the guacamole and place some cheese or mayonnaise or anything like that. So I get my good fats, it'll help fill me up. And we will be ready for the afternoon. Lots of work to do. I'll show you the finished product here in just a second. Of course, some sliced tomato on there that I showed you on the counter earlier. That's going on there too. Okay, so remember, when you're cutting the tomatoes, you want a really, really nice, sharp, serrated knife that works the best. There's nothing worse in life than cutting a tomato with a knife that's not sharp enough. So you want to make sure you've got a nice, sharp knife so that you can just slice. And I like it really, really thin. It really helps bring out the taste in the tomato. I, I turn Carl onto this, and of course now, got to cut them that way for him every time he has a sandwich. Okay, three slices ought to do it. We'll save the rest for later. Okay, we're going to bring the bread out of the toaster. Plate it up here. Bread's going to come down. We're going to spread a little guacamole on both sides. Now, be careful with guacamole. If you're limited to a certain number of calories per day, you want to be, be careful, it can add up fast in the guacamole. I need, you know, 3,500, sometimes 4,000 calories a day, so I'm going to be liberal with the guacamole. I've cut the chicken in half for two reasons, to make sure it was done and to help fit it on the bread. I'm going to place my tomatoes on there. Flip it over. Cut it in half. Beautiful. Now, if I wasn't so hungry, I would save half of this for my snack later. Okay, not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but look at that. Grilled chicken sandwich with guacamole and fresh tomatoes and some fresh peaches on the plate. Gotta love it. Now, if I wasn't so hungry, I'd save half of this for a snack later this afternoon, but it's been a while since my last meal, so I'm going to eat probably most of that. Wrap this other chicken breast up for tomorrow. Got the guacamole ready to go for tomorrow. So tomorrow's lunch is all set. And of course that guacamole will last me another day or two too in various things. And it's beautiful. Quick lunch, that took me about 15 minutes. So it seems like much more preparation than it actually is. It's gonna probably take me another 10 minutes to clean up. So all said and done, a half hour of good intention around the nourishment of me and my body and my spirit. This is John Ashworth, the Fitness Health.